Hi folks, it's the wife here. Look how green the grass is getting, what we left down behind. That's how much rain we've had lately. I have been working, so we haven't had as many videos. Uh, we are going to try a new format instead of trying to finish one project from beginning to end. We're going to put videos up as we take them. I had a couple days off. So we made a Home Depot run today. I got this nice little aloe plant and a couple of succulents. This little alien looking one here. I just stuck them in with the cacti that we found on the property. And then this little alien looking dude over here. Or dudette, could be. I'll get them planted in a planter. Maybe tomorrow if I'm lucky. In the meantime, we are just in a waiting game. Let me uh, pause for a moment while I walk over to show you what we're waiting on. As I said, we are in a waiting game. We ordered our shed three weeks ago. It takes six to eight weeks for it to be delivered. <sighs> Excuse me, I'm a little out of breath lately for some reason, maybe because of the higher altitude. What we have done in the meantime is marked out where the cabin is going to go. So this is an extremely small space. We've put one foot on either side of the dimensions. That is a 10 by 16 hours the dimensions of the cabin, so 12 by 18 for this. And then if you notice this little L-shaped patch over here, that will eventually be an extension for an indoor bathroom. Yay! I know he hates when I say yay all the time. And then our weird little dog, Marco, has picked this spot as his. I don't know why. None of us do. Currently, he is sitting in my chair. He thinks that's his chair. I have to fight him for it all the time. Poor baby had a long day riding with us to Home Depot and back. So what I didn't mention is we have decided to go with a washed gravel for our base for the cabin. <clears throat> it's supposed to pack down like our driveway did and with a little bit larger rock so that water can wash through it without disturbing the uh, formation. We picked up the cement blocks that the cabin will be sitting on. And thanks to my mom. Thanks mom. She orders, ordered us some landscape timbers from Home Depot. I hate to say it even though I'm a former Home Depot employee. This wood is just crap. It's like you can't get good lumber anymore. Besides those deep splits are on almost every single wood. That one's obviously been used. And then, let's see if I can get a picture of this. You can see how warped the one that this one is sitting on. This one. Again, very warped. And then a second warp with all the wood piled on it. It's not even sitting on the ground. Well, that's it for us today. Like I said, we're just waiting. Eventually, we'll, we'll be in our little tiny shed and be fixing that up. But I hope you stay with us. Like, subscribe, and share if you like our videos. Thanks everybody.